Hi, I'm Patrick Olson. And I'm Stephen Markley. And we're here today to give you Cars.com's top 10 tailgating vehicles. We're going to count them down from number 10 to number one, the most awesome tailgating car. And I'll be here to help you along, Patrick, since you know I've actually been enrolled in a college in the last two decades. Great, Steve. Let's go on to number 10 here. First up at number 10 is the Lexus LX570. It's got the slow dropping uh, gate, holds up to 400 pounds. I could fit, you could fit three of me on there. I could fit maybe one and a half of me on here. Right. What also is cool in the LX is it's got this nifty seat that it powers down and then you can get it to power up onto the side of the car. Ah, a useful $2,000 feature for people who don't have arms. Indeed. Coming in at number 9 is the 2008 Ford Expedition EL. Now it's a big car, but with all that size comes a ton of cargo space, more than 42 cubic feet in the back. And in addition, you can fit eight full-size adults in there. Yeah, great. And only $200 in gas, three fill-ups on your way to the game. Sounds good. Exactly. Number eight is the 2008 GMC Acadia. Now what's really cool in the Acadia is one of my favorite features for any tailgating car are the stereo controls are in the back. So when you want to crank your music, I like the Beatles, you can do that without having to run up to the front. In addition, there's four 12-volt outlets and a 115-volt outlet, like a regular household plug, in the back. Perfect for a hair dryer, right? The hair dryer you're going to bring to that game you're tailgating? Yeah. Moving on. At number seven is the 2008 Dodge Nitro. Now, it's got this cool load-and-go floor that carries up to 400 pounds and moves a foot and a half back. So if you need help reaching to the condiments or if you want to use it at a buffet table, it works great. Perfect for you and the rest of the AARP crowd, huh? Thanks, Steve. Let's move on to number five. The so tied for number fifth is the Dodge Journey. Now, what's cool about this, and this car is new for this year from Dodge, they've got these great in-the-floor coolers. You get eight cans of soda in there and ice. That's good. I like that. Yeah, it's not too shabby. And then in the front, if there's stuff that you don't need to get to too much and you want to keep hidden, there's a little storage compartment under the passenger That's seat. That's not mine. That's not mine. Yeah, I'm sure, Steve. Over here, our tied for fifth is, is the Honda Ridgeline. It's one of our favorite tailgating vehicles of all time. And the reason we like it so much is not just that you have the tailgate you can swing out this way, which is unusual, but you've got nine cubic feet of storage in here. And so you can put all sorts of soda, food, whatever you Lots need in here for the whole thing. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. I'm sure you know all about that, Steve. I, I know something about it, yeah. Okay, you know, when you're at the tailgating, you want to have your music. So number four is a Dodge Caliber. What's cool about this, you know, if you want to, you know, I was talking about the Beatles earlier, if you want to blast right. your ACDC or Boston, bam. There you go. Yeah, I bet the police sound great coming out of they those. They do. Do you, do you like the police? I love the police. You and I yeah. probably have the same iPod. Oh, I'm sure. I'm sure. Number three on our list is you know, what a lot of people really consider for tailgating. It's a Jeep Wrangler. It seats five people comfortably. It's got a floor you can wash out. And it's got these speakers right here so you can really rock out when you need to. Yeah, get your wham on there. Right? George Michael, he's a genius. Right. All right. All right. Number two on our list is a Honda Element. Now, this car is pretty cool for a lot of reasons. One, it's a unique styling. But two, it's got the floor you can wash out. And it's got the chairs that you can bolt to the side of the car safely and get plenty of storage in there. And they come all the way down, too. They do. They, I don't know why you do it, but they fold so flat. After a long, hard tailgate, you could need that. I could see that. I could see you needing that. But, you know, you got to hang on now, Steve. For number one on our list, it is the ultimate tailgating car. Oh, some awesome, beastly four-wheeler. It has four wheels, something like that. All right. Hang I'll on right on. here. Yeah. Okay. So, Steve, what do you think, huh? Our number one tailgating car. Patrick, the, I the, ain't the been the in a game for but no self-respecting college student is going to tailgate in a, in a minivan. Yeah, that's where you're going to show, Steve. Pop down the third row like this, and instead of having to sit on milk crates or something else that's uncomfortable, you get to sit on these very comfortable seats. Yeah. You've got serious satellite television. I can get Nickelodeon or Disney on it. They say ESPN is next, if they can figure it out. You got a handy table inside. You got swivel seats, so when everyone else is out here getting soaked by the rain or the snow, you're nice and warm. So what do you think? All right, I'll give it a try. All right, hop in the front. We'll head off to the game. For more car-related news, go to cars.com or our blog, Kicking Tires.